First of all, the city of Columbus is very proud of how far we've come in a relatively short period of time. In fact, I think our fleet was rated as the number one fleet in America in terms of the greenest fleet in America uh, last year, and we're proud of that as well. We in 2007 made a very important decision that to this day has made a huge difference to the city of Columbus and to our citizens and to our taxpayers. In 2007, the city of Columbus, we all made a decision to, uh, to, to look at the use of fuel and the fact that we were buying all this fuel from foreign companies and we said we have to change our practices. In changing our practices, we needed to focus in on uh, buying cheaper fuel, less expensive, more efficient, and as well uh, uh, protect the environment, protect the air. Our cost savings are significant. Right now it's $300,000 a year. And by the year 2020, we will save up to $2 million a year. Now imagine that. $2 million a year over a period of 10 years with those kind of savings, $20 million. It was a win-win for us. And the biggest challenge is that we, had, we didn't have any infrastructure. But we knew it was the right thing to do in the right direction for our community. So we invested in, in CNG stations, uh, CNG vehicles. So we have four CNG stations uh, that we're planning. One is already constructed, another one that we're breaking ground, and a third one we're identifying a site, and the fourth one is in the planning stages. Those are public stations as well, and so it's open to the public. Not just the city vehicles, but private vehicles as well can fill up. So we have 46 CNG vehicles, mostly garbage trucks and heavy-duty trucks, some five electric vehicles, and well over 600 uh, flex vehicles. We're leading the nation in many ways in this regard. We're proud of our progress. I think Clean Fuels Ohio was great. It provided us resources to jumpstart the CNG stations. It gave us over a million dollars to buy heavy duty trucks, electric charging stations, to get us started down this road. Very important to us. It is important that we take a leadership role. It's also important that other cities like Columbus uh, get engaged in alternative fuels for their vehicles and for their population. Why? It's easy. The savings one receives as a result of using uh, alternative fuel because how it protects the environment and the air that we breathe. And three is we're just so much more efficient and a better city as a result. Those are three good reasons.